What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're gonna talk about the seven things that I hate about my 2017 Dodge Challenger. First thing that I hate about my car are the tires. The stock tires on this car, I'm gonna just be honest with you, they suck. They're the Goodyear Eagle F1s and it's just a terrible tire for this car. I actually already switched my tires because I just couldn't take it anymore with all the wheel spin. I have 275 now and uh, they're, they're pretty good. I still will spin a little bit, but they're way better than the 245s. The 245s just should not be on a scat pack at all. The second thing I hate about my car are the power windows. I hate the fact that they slide down automatically, but then when I want them to go back up, I have to put my finger and hold it on the button for it to go back up, as you see here. The third thing that I hate about my Dodge Challenger is no auto start. So I can't do the cool cold start videos without being in the car. Wait for it. Yeah, it's not gonna auto start. Number four, this is something that um, honestly was a big gripe about the car because I just personally thought it was just a bad job in the first place for the dealer. But uh, the tint that came on the car um, to me is a bad job. I don't know how much of this is gonna get on camera, but you'll see the lines are not straight. And it honestly just looks like, you know, whoever did this just didn't really pay attention to detail. And I'm not a big fan of the color either. So, uh, yeah, I really hate the tint on this car. I plan to replace it soon in a video to come, so stay tuned for that. Number five. This, I think, is speaking for anybody in the Challenger community, Mopar community. But, and I've never actually seen this um, in seven things I hate about my car video but when you wash a Dodge Challenger there's an absurd amount of water that collects in the trunk area of the car so when you lift your trunk like so and you've already finished drying your car all this water in this area will just come falling out and wet your car all over again um, it's very annoying and in a way I kind of feel like it might be a design flaw, but I'm not sure. But yeah, either way, it's very annoying. And I'm pretty sure anybody that hand washes their car or hand washes a Challenger, I should say, goes through this problem. Number six, something else that I hate about my car are that the brake calipers are not red. Yes, I know. I probably could have looked for a destroyer gray car that had red brake calipers. But guess what? This one didn't, and this is the one I took. So I plan to change these red eventually. But yeah, this is um, another thing that I hate about my Dodge Challenger because they just don't pop when I'm driving around town and I want them to pop. All right, guys, we're at number seven. Something that I really don't understand myself. But on my Dodge Challenger, which is a 2017, I have yellow halogen bulbs. On all of my friends' cars, they have white LEDs, or at least I think they're LEDs, but long story short, the light is white and mine's isn't. I'm not really sure why, and I'm probably most likely gonna change it to white, and uh, it's just something that's just been quite annoying, because when I see other challengers, they have white bulbs. This is a perfect example, shout out to my friend Nick. His challenger, which is a scat pack, a 2016 scat pack at that, has white bulbs and my 2017 Challenger has yellow bulbs. I don't understand why this happens, but every other Challenger that I see has white bulbs except for mine. And I'm probably gonna change that so that I have white bulbs as well, but I just don't understand why mines couldn't come with white bulbs. And I didn't notice this when I was purchasing the car, but stay tuned on my channel and I'll be changing those bulbs shortly. All right guys, those are the seven things I hate about my car. Keep in mind, I actually don't hate my car at all. I was just trying to find things to basically say why I hate my car, but I actually really love my car. Um, I wouldn't trade it for anything in the world, but uh, you know, this video's done, and uh, catch you on the next video.